Hey YouTube, it's me KMC Stilo. I'm back with another haul. I feel like all I do late all I do is um film haul lately. Um at hauls I need to kind of work on something different, but hopefully in the near future is that I haven't really had much time for anything and um a lot of the stuff I I had bought and I had just um put away waiting for to have time to film the hauls for you guys so it's not all, all of the hauls that I've been filming lately they're not really stuff that I recently bought so it's not like I'm constantly buying stuff um this one right now it's gonna be from Dollar Tree this bag is one of those um disposable um reusable bags and I thought it was pretty cute it's pink and then it has like the breast cancer logo and I always want to support um in any way that i can so i was like you know what i need a disposable i need i mean not i didn't really need another reusable bag i have so many in the house but um at the time i felt that i needed it to kind of help me carry the bags home and also i i thought it was for a good cause um i'm hoping some of the you know maybe the dollar goes or some of the proceeds goes to, goes to um fighting breast cancer so um, but let me just go ahead because I don't have that much battery. So let me just go ahead and start sharing what I got this trip um, from Dollar Tree. I actually went because I'm trying to declutter and organize um, at home. And I went and I wanted to get um, a couple of things to kind of help me organize um what i'm not getting rid of t during the my decluttering stage and um the last time that i went to dollar tree i found these goodies um i'm not really sure if i filmed the whole showing you guys but these i bought today um i have bought these i have bought two of these these are like acrylic uh, clear containers the quality is so awesome you guys and for just a dollar they were perfect so i went i happened to go to dollar tree about two weeks ago so this is gonna be um a video on two trips because i went back today and i um the stuff that i bought two weeks ago i'm gonna include in this haul as well but two weeks ago i went and i bought two of these two acrylic uh organizers this size and then I also bought one this size and two this size and so when I brought them home I realized that they were perfect um, for organizing my makeup and organizing a few other knickknacks um, in these uh, plastic clear drawer compartments that I have and so I went back today and I was hoping to find more of um, each of the sizes but fortunately they only had um, this size left and they only have five left so I just um, went ahead and bought um, all five and then I was able to find this one this one is not acrylic it's plastic but it's also um, the quality feels like pretty good doesn't feel that bad and um, I can definitely use use it in uh, one of my containers. Um, the only issue is that this one does seem to be a bit deeper than the other ones. As you, let me show you guys. See, like these are a little lower in size, but hopefully they'll fit um, in one of my um, in the drawers. Um, maybe once I have everything organized and decluttered and stuff, I can share with you guys how I used um, these containers in my to organize my makeup and uh, probably some of my stationery and stuff. So I'll probably share that with you guys later on. And moving on, I also bought, I didn't find much when I went. I went two weeks ago or about a week ago. I found those containers. I went back today hoping they still had some more. I only found one size, but you know, at least I found something. And then I also found uh, these. And these come three for a dollar. And um, I wasn't, I, they're plastic. The plastic is it's not as, as sturdy, but it's still like pretty good, like, you know, for a dollar. And I could definitely use these 
to organize um, some of my makeup. Um, I would have preferred them to be clear or white, but they didn't have, and so I really need um, some organizers, so I just went ahead and bought it anyways. I figured, you know, what the heck, what the hey. But um, I was pretty happy because I was, I got, um, the last time that I went out about a week ago, I didn't find that much like stationary stuff. And I was pretty bummed because my little cousin actually ended up going um, the same day and she found like these cute little labels. And I was like, oh my God, where'd you find? She was like, oh, Dollar Tree. And I was like, oh my God, I didn't see those when I went. So I went, when I went back today, I actually uh, found them. These are supposed to be like chalk labels. Although they just seem like stickers to me. They don't really seem like chalk. But I'm hoping that I could at least the use like neon sharpies to write on them. So these bring, they, these are the design of these and they bring eight to each pack. So I bought two packs of those. And they also had these, which I really love, um, because they remind me of, like, the ones that are, like, craft paper colored, but they're not, like, paper, they're, like, stickers more like it, but these bring, yeah, like, craft paper labels, but they're not really, like, the craft paper material, like the ones from the Target Dollar Spot. These are more, like, that laminated, like, sticker quality, but these bring 30, and then these, they also had those in, um, this design as well and these bring 50 so I didn't go overboard I didn't go buy like a you know a whole bunch and then I know that they had like when my little cousin went she found these in like different designs as well but I only found this design in, th in these colored ones so I bought this design and this these bring 40 so um check out your Dollar Tree because they have a, a lot of variety of these labels right now um so, what else did I get? I got a pack of gum. Because <laughs> I always try to have um, some gum in, in my purse. Especially for, like, after I eat. That's, like, the only time that I sh like to chew gum. Um, I also uh, thought this was pretty cute. It's just, like, a bubble mailer. But I love that fact that it's the size of it and the fact that it's red. And I figured, like, it would be great to like mail a little gift or something like that or maybe even a rack I haven't mailed I haven't done a rack in like such a long time so maybe um and I've been meaning to do one too so maybe I'll go that this little thing will inspire me to send out a little one and then they actually they, they've always had these little storage collapsible containers but now like before they had them in these like either plain colors or like these ugly stripes and I wasn't too convinced with them and when I saw this one in this design I thought it was so pretty so I picked one up of these um, I would have picked up another size or another one but they didn't have any more of this color and, and this um, pattern and this matches perfectly with two sets of um, plastic drawer containers that I have um, that are purple so I figure like I had to pick that up just to kind of work that in there um and something else that's stationary that i found out of luck i just happened to turn around and then i saw this they had these um calendar stickers it brings 290 and then let me see if i could do a close-up it has like for trips like theater zoo aquarium museum book club family fun library play date and then i guess um for the movies party sleepover and then, um, oh, it has, these are pretty cute. They say appointment, and they have space for you to write, like, what type of appointment. I kind of like those. See, I w if I would have seen, if I would have noticed this, I probably would have picked up more packs of these. Because I bet you, I'm sorry for the sirens, you guys. My bedroom, I have a big window in my bedroom, and, yeah, you pretty much hear everything that goes on outside. Okay. But if I would have noticed these, I love how the fact that they're like, I can write in them. I would have bought a few more packs because by the time I go back, my Dollar Tree's a bit far away from me. So by the time I go back, there's probably not going to be any more of those. But, oh well, at least I, I found a, and bought a pack. And then another thing that I was like super excited about was that they 
had washi tape again. The last time I was able to find some of the ones that they had, I was pretty surprised that they brought back um, some more. So I picked this one up. Um, it's like the gold glittery kind. I don't, I don't, I believe I don't have any of these, and these are, I feel like they would be perfect for decorating um, a card. So I got that one for that with that purpose. Then I bought this one. I love Paris themed stuff, and um, I thought this one was so cute. Uh, let's see, it says Paris, and then it has like little stamps, and these are so adorable. Then it has this one. I like the design of it. I like that it's black and white. And I I really like that they had like different designs from the ones that they had the last time. And then this one is actually similar to the ones that they had the last time. But I never picked this one up. So um, I decided to pick it up this time. So I was pretty happy with that. Like I wasn't really expecting... Other than the labels that I knew that they had because of my little cousin, like, buying them when she won, I didn't know that I was going to buy any more stationary stuff or find any more stationary stuff. So I was happy to found, have found those stickers and um, the washi tape. And then, let's see what else do I have. Let's see, I'm like rummaging through my bags, making sure. Okay. So I do have, oh, all right. There's actually another washi tape. It's this one. I thought it was pretty interesting because even though it's just stripes, and the white stripes, I don't know if you guys can tell, it kind of has glitter. So I thought that was pretty interesting, and then that would look pretty cute with whatever, like, I choose to um, decorate with it. Oh, I'm trying to see if you guys can tell, like, it has glitter on the white lines. And I saw um, this scotch tape. I think I have this pattern actually in like the small size um, of scotch tape, duct tape. But um, I figure this is awesome for any packages that I want to send to kind of seal them and then at the same time decorate them. And they had these again, which I love. These are so super cute. They're like baby EOS lip balms, but they're by Chap Eyes. And they're just so cute. And I picked one up in cherry and strawberry. They also had it in watermelon. But I'm not like crazy about watermelon. So I just decided to pick up um, these. But they are just so super cute. They're like compared to the EOS. They're like super like so much smaller. They're like half the size of a regular EOS lip balm. So they fit more perfectly in like any size purse. I feel like they won't take up that much room. And then for a makeup sort of related stuff on this trip, um, I bought these vitamin C iPads. Um, I don't sleep too well either. I takes long for me to wake up and I toss and turn all night. And then by the time I actually am able to get some sleep, um, it's time to wake up or I oversleep too much or it's always something. I don't have like I've never had like a good um, sleep pattern and so I get a lot of bags under my eyes. I I don't get too much darkness but I do get like um, puffy eyes way too much. So I want to start using like eye, <laughs> eye things and I figured what the hey let me try this it's only a dollar so you never know. And then they had these and um, you guys I'm like a sucker for eyeshadow. And I love how this is by, I have no idea, I think the brand is, is well, it says Twinkle Twinkle Profusion, H I eight shades of eyeshadow, and um, perfect your look, and I guess the name of this little palette is Nude, and it's cute because it kind of reminds me of like the Naked palettes, because it has like those kind of, or like the Nude palette from Revlon, the new, no, I think it's Maybelline, yeah, Maybelline has like a new Nude palette as well and so I figured let me give it a try because I am crazy for like my everyday look I love brown tones that's like my my go-to colors um, brown eyeshadow and earth tone colors and I figure like these colors are so beautiful 
So I'm hoping like the color payoff is pretty good. Um, they kind of they look like such beautiful, beautiful, beautiful colors. And for a dollar, like not bad. And I'm hoping like the there they end up being like oh, okay the pigmentation pigmentation doesn't look well. That one looks kind of pretty good though. See, it seems like the ones that are like more glittery have more pigment than the ones that are seem to be somewhat matte. Let me test these two out because these are gorgeous. See like they're not. I am going to give them a try though because sometimes like when you swatch stuff on your fingers that on oh, see these are not not bad. But sometimes when you swatch stuff on your fingers, ooh, not not bad at all. Um they don't Wash that well, and then when you put them on on your eyelid, they actually end up looking like pretty nice. So I gotta give them a try. Wear them. Maybe I'll wear them tomorrow to work or something, or on Saturday. Which is mainly the day that I choose to wear makeup to work, since it's like a weekend thing day. So let me move on to the items that I bought when I went a week ago. Um, so I bought this for my hair. It's the Daily Defense Argan Oil from Morocco Shampoo. And then I also bought the conditioner. Um, I wasn't sure if I had bought this one because I believe that they had these like a while back. So I don't remember if I had bought them or not. But, you know, I know that Argan Oil is so good for your hair. And I figured like... This shampoo, I have to give it a try. It has to be good if it really does have argan oil from Morocco. <laughs> so I just like picked it up. I wasn't sure if I had already bought them, but I figured, you know, whatever. Like shampoo and conditioner is something that you're always going to need. So even if I had already bought it, um, I'm eventually going to get around to using it. And then I, they had these microwave cooking covers. It comes two covers to a pack. Um... I bought them not necessarily with the idea of wear, of using them, sorry, not wearing them, but using them as um, microwave covers, although I could use them for that, but see, this is how they look. They look like the ones that um, are the big ones that come like as cutting mats. That's exactly what they look like, but in smaller sizes. And um, I don't know if you guys have seen, but some girls like cut these up and use them as dividers for their planners or just to kind of use them for organizational purposes. I actually have one of the big ones and use them as like a little mat when I'm putting on my makeup so that way like it doesn't mess up like my vanity. So there's like multi-purposes for these little um, mats. So I picked up like two packs of these little ones. So I figured, like, they're little. I don't even have to cut them down. And so I bought uh, one of these. I love these aluminum foil sheets because they already come, um, like, already cut up. You just open it in the middle, and then you pull them out individually like they're already cut for you. So that's awesome. And then they, I hadn't seen this size um, before. Usually by the ones that are, like, up to here. So... I had to pick that size up. I actually picked up two and gave one to my aunt. And I saw these foam stickers. I don't know if they've had them there before, but I just recently like noticed them. So it brings 124 foam letter stickers. And I figured these are also good um, for like projects or cards or stuff like that and this is how they are they're foam and then you just kind of peel them off and they're stickers so I figured I picked two up because I figured if my son has a project he needs to do for school I can give him one of those and he can use it um and um I can pick, pick uh, keep the other one for me and then they also had these these are by Aquafina and these look like Oh man, I forgot the brand. There's another brand because I bought one. I also have a brand of those. But there's another brand of these. Let me see if I find it. Oh, by Soft Lips. Okay, here it is. Soft Lips has the same type of chapstick. 
and so when I went to Dollar Tree I noticed that Aquafina now this is like Aquafina's um, version of the soft lips uh, cube chapstick so this is how they look side to side isn't that awesome so I actually picked up two of these I'm not sure where I put the other one but thought it was pretty cool because they're only a dollar and those soft lips ones are like three something or like four something because I think I'm, they might actually be more expensive than the EO, EOS and I've used Aquafina chapsticks before they're really they're pretty good they're really good so I recommend these you guys if you guys are like chapstick addicts like I am and then they also had these little um envelopes so they were pretty cool they're plastic and they are like envelope fo envelope form so I picked these up in green they also had these stickers they're like bubbles so I figured I could use them to kind of write like little messages on pictures and stuff like that because that's what people used to use those type before back in the day and they had these cute little owl stickers I could not keep myself from buying them hopefully you guys can see this I bought two packs of those I'm trying to hurry up because my battery is about to die and then the last thing that I bought were these um sandwich bags from the movie Frozen it brings 20 little Ziploc bags aren't these adorable the last time I think I bought the I, I think it was the Hello Kitty ones and I sent like little my little cousins like little goodie bags and each one of in like in the little Hello Kitty Ziploc bag. So they're actually pretty good. Pretty you don't need to use them like for food. You can use them like to just use them as little goodie bags because they're like they have the little stippler closure. So they're kind of like nicer than the ones that you have to use like the little tie. So that was my haul. Um sorry if I rushed, but my battery's about to die. And um, I hope you guys got some ideas and head out to your local Dollar Tree because they always have such great things. Like I'm so excited about some of the labels that I found and the chapsticks. And I can't wait to try that shampoo and conditioner. Hopefully it works good for my hair because my hair has been getting so dry and my ends are have been getting so many split ends. So I need to try and take better care of it. Um, I'm going to let you guys go and I'll see you in my next video. Have a good night everyone.